Well, first of all, uh, being here, uh, as, as far as I know, the first Polish composer ever to be featured on the Film City Festival uh, is, is a great honor, uh, also considering the fact that, well, I'm actually a game composer, primarily not, not film score composer, so, you know, uh, being Polish, being here for the first time, having uh, a video game presented on a film music festival is, is like a double honor for me. Uh, especially that I found uh, that the day we presented The Witcher 3 music was the same day the music of Miklos Rosha, uh, Elmer Bernstein, James Horner, you know, Hans Zimmer were presented. So being in that company of, of musical giants is, is, was one of its kind of experience actually for me. My attempt with Masterclass was to uh, share some knowledge with the area of expertise I'm feeling most comfortable with, so again, video games. Uh, and I thought that it was also good, uh, good tactics actually, because apart from me, there were like, you know, the best experts in the film industry. Uh, Craig Stewart Garfinkel, uh, Matthias Kibum, you know, uh, Richard Bellis. Those guys are giants, so and and, and they can really do wonders uh, in terms of you know teaching people uh, about uh, film music business in general. So I thought that my addition would be uh, focused solely on working with video game developers, uh, establishing relationships between emerging composers and game creators, uh, you know, and trying to help those people actually score full gigs, full projects, full games, and build their careers basically and I hope it was helpful for them at least they liked it so you know. well I think that um, our uh, profession is um, it may sound weird but but uh, bear with me our profession is uh, a bit like doctors um, uh, uh, profession because Basically, we need to learn every single day. The world is changing, the world is progressing, and, and we, as an artist, have to do the same thing. So, my advice would be to never let go the learning curve, to you know, work on your craft constantly, uh, expand your musical knowledge, expand your, all your own musical dialect and style, uh, and be very humble uh, to your work because after all, you're not doing this for yourself, you're doing this for your audience. And the audience needs to accept you uh, and respect you. Wow, um, seriously, you just have to be here. Um, it's that simple. The, uh, the whole atmosphere and um, the opportunity to uh, experience music performed on stage is, is something you just cannot express with words, especially if you're film music junkie or, or you're just you know, movie enthusiast and you, love to look, and you like to go to the movies, to the cinema. You, you just have to be here to experience uh, this, this magical spark we, we are having here and actually after you try, you're never gonna want to stop. It's, it's like heroin basically.